What's going on guys? Mr. AG here bringing you a live Pokemon ORS battle and this time it's up against the one the only G Hammer. We're gonna go ahead and stroll over to music number three and we're gonna pick this team and hope for the best here right now. We've been trying out some new teams, mixing some things up and so yeah we're gonna give it a try. We'll see what happens. Alright and look at G Hammer's team. Oh my word that is power. That's pure power. Um, yeah, I think he's going to win. Just straight off, I think he's going to win. I really don't think we have a chance, but we're going to give it our best shot like we always do, guys. Because we always give it our best shot. Hit me with your best shot. Dun, dun, dun. Why don't you hit me with your best shot? Hit me with your best shot. Fire away. Sorry, guys. Get into it. Getting into it. Okay, so there's his team. Uh, I don't know. How are we going to deal with that? So he's got, obviously, the Talon Flame, the Conkledur, the Blast Strikes, the Gardevoir, the Rotom Wash, and the Darn Freaking Mammal Swine. All power. All of it. Um, and we've got our Claudia, Aflac, Charizard, Tentacruel, Tim Allen, and Dargonite. So, huh. Not really sure how we're going to deal with this. It's a good question. How do we want to deal with this? Um, let us go ahead and lead off with... Gosh, I don't know. This is too tough. Too tough for me. Um, let's go ahead and lead off like this anyways. Oh god. Oh god, I don't have time! I don't have time! Okay, I don't even know what I picked first now. Good lord, I don't even know what I picked first. But here we go against G Hammer, guys. Wish me the best of luck. We'll see how it turns out. Urgh! G Hammer's issuing a challenge. He's gonna lead off with Mount King Zero. The big old freaking mammal swan. Big old freaking mammal swan. And we've got Amber Palm out here. Nice and Amber Palm. I'm gonna go ahead and throw that fake out at him. Break that sash like we need to. But drawing Mount King Zero, what's coming out instead? Something's going to take a little bit of damage. It's Kame Jr. Kame Jr., the Blastoise, out of all things. I'm going to go ahead and throw this fake out at him. Yoink. Oh my gosh, didn't expect all that damage from a fake out? Good lord. Okay, so, got some damage. What is that, leftovers? Okay, so leftovers. we got to figure out what to get out and change into here. Huh. It's Kame! Too strong for us. So let's do this. Here's what we're planning on doing. We're going to go ahead and U-turn out. Yoink. Wow, get quite a bit of damage there. And um, we're going to switch out. And we are going to go ahead and send out... Who do I want to send out? Let's send out this guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here comes Tentacruel. So Tentacruel's coming out now, making his appearance... And here comes a skull to our tentacle. Survival! Yeah, buddy. It's not very effective. We get burned, though. That's unfortunate. Oh, that burn. Black sludge. Thank goodness for that. We, we are able to eat it up. Thank goodness for that. Let's see what Kame Jr. is going to do now. Oh, that burn! Oh! Come on, tentacruel. Come on, tentacruel. What are we going to do here up against Kame Jr. here? Who knows? We'll find out. We're drawing Kame Jr. Let's see what's coming out instead. Here comes Washer Mat. Oh, God. Not the Washer Mat. No! Rotom Wash is here. We're going to Giga Drain the Rotom Wash. Nice and Giga Drain. Take about uh, one-third of his health away. Get that health back, which we need. And we take that burn. So all the damage in the burn. All the damage in the blame. How do we want to deal with this Rotom Wash? We're going to deal with it a few different ways. He's going to... He can't burn us. We're already burnt. He's probably going to Volt Switch, Discharge, or thunder, or Thunderbolt, or one of the above. You guys know what he does. Um, if he really wants to, he could be a Toxic set, but I don't know why he would. So who to switch out is the question. Um, let's see here. Obviously, we could go ahead and go into... One of our physical pokes and should be able to take out Washer Map, but I don't know. 
Alright, let's do this. Here we go. We're gonna get another Giga Drain off here. Nice and Giga Drain. Nice and damage. Let's see what's gonna happen now. Um, Volt Switch. Okay. That happened. Can we survive it? Oh, wow. We barely survived. Good lord. That was a crit. Ugh. That crit. Mmm. Did not really need that crit to happen. That crit really just blew our minds. It was like, dang it. Right after we did all that draining, too. So now it's like, great. What are we going to do? Um, Queen Falco comes in. We got Queen Falco here. We are going to get some health back. Thank goodness from that Black Sludge. And then we've got the darn burn. The freaking burn. Oh boy, Queen Falco. What am I going to do about Queen Falco? Suggestions, I'll gladly take them. Um, let's go ahead and send out this guy. Yeah, we'll do this. Here we go. Switching out Tentacruel, we're going to save him just in case we need him later. And we're going to send out Aflac. Aflac comes out. We're going to trace Gale Wings. Not that that matters. And I wouldn't be surprised if he switched out too. No, he's going straight for the Brave Bird. So here comes Brave Bird. We should be able to eat that up pretty well. There we go. Nice and eating. Do, 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 do. All right, so we can just Thunderbolt this Queen Falco and be good to go. So we're okay with this right now. We are okay with this. Yes, sir. Dun, 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 dun. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Once it happens. Actually, you know what? Let us do this first. Because we don't want to set up self, ourselves up for failure. He's going to withdraw. I think he's going to go probably into Conkledur. Mount King Zero. Okay, didn't expect that. Now King Zero's back here. We're going to go ahead and get a recover off. Nice and recover. Okay. I fully expect, like, a um, stealth rocks or something to happen next. Let's see here. We'll find out. We'll find out. Aflac, come back. And we're going to send out Tentacruel. Tentacruel coming out. Stealth rock. Okay, so there's a the stealth rock. And we're going to take a burn after Black Sludge damage. Now, I don't know if he's locked into that. I hope he is. If he is, then we might get a Giga Drain off. If not, he's probably faster and going to take us out. Giga Drain! We'll see. We will see. He obviously could switch out to, like, Talonflame if he wants to right now, but he doesn't want to stick around for Giga Drain. Well, he probably could stick around and Earthquake us and kill us, but that's his prerogative if that's what he wants to do. We'll find out. We know we're faster than the darn Blastoise, but I'm not so sure about this Mount King Zero. The big old pig. Big old pig. Reminds me of Pumbaa. If I had one, I would name him Pumbaa. I really would. So let's see what G Hammer does next. Da dum dum. Um, eventually, we will find out. All right, withdrawing. Let's see what he's going to do now. Washer Mat's going to come out again. So we're going to be able to Giga Drain Washer Man, finish off Washer Man. All right. All right, all right. Um, let's see what's going to happen now. Um, do 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 Take that burn. But we do finish off one poke, so the Washer Man is now gone, guys. I like the name, though. It's a very original name. Washer Mat, done. Let's see what's going to come out next. What is G Hammer going to pull out here? Elena. Oh, shoot. Look at that girl. She's going to trace clear body, so nobody's going to be able to lower her stats or anything. Do, 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 do. 
do... Elena could do a lot of damage to us. I'm figuring out how to deal with her. Let's go ahead and deal with Elena by doing... Do, 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 do. Let's do this. Elena could be power. Elena could, like, absolutely just demolish our team, guys. She really could. So we're going to go ahead and send out Charizard now. Charizard's here. It's going to take stone damage. What? I didn't know that they had stones up. I forgot. I just blew that, guys. I did not... I totally forgot that stones were up. I am stupid. Because I would have just rapid spin right there and sacked off my tentacle. Wow. I just totally failed it, guys. I just totally lost it. I totally just lost it, guys. Wow, now my Tentacruel can't even come in now. He'll go down to Stealth Rush, most likely. Wow, I totally blew that, guys. Oh, my goodness. That was totally on me, guys. Totally on me. We're going to send out Aflac. We're going to copy the Clear Body now. Or Pixelate. His, his ability is now Clear Body, dude. Oh, my gosh. No, he Mega. That's right. He Mega, so that changed Clear Body to that. Oh my goodness, what? How did that happen? That's just... It's ridiculous. Just mistake, mistake, critical mistake. Oh my gosh. Had I remembered it was up, I would have just sacked off my darn tentacle and just done a stupid rapid spin. As it is now, he's kind of useless to me now. Because when he comes in, he's going to go down, most likely. Uh, being a water type, eh, maybe not. We'll see. We'll see. I know I don't have enough HP. I'll probably go down. So I probably don't have to worry about him anymore. With drawing Alana, what's coming out? Probably Mount King Zero blah 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 again. Yep, there's Mount King Zero blah blah blah. Thunder Wave's obviously not going to affect him. It's a good switch. Good switch. He knows my guy very well. Alright, so what to do now? Gosh, that so upsets me. It really does. Oh my goodness. I can't believe that happened. I really can't. That really just blew my mind out. Oh goodness. Alright, so we're going to just do this here. We're going to throw... Here comes an Earthquake. That's fine. So we can survive an Earthquake. We're going to throw Ice Beams at him. We're going to do nice and little damage. I'm okay with this exchange. If this is what he wants to do. Because we can always recover. Ice go crash going for the flinches. Those flinches. Ice beam away. Wow, we took him down to core. So we're doing about one eighth every attack right now. As far as damage is concerned. Here's another ice go crash. Not a mess. Hopefully it doesn't flinch. The flinch would be absolutely brutal right now. No, well, maybe not. There's a flinch. There's a flinch. Now he could Earthquake, and that could hurt me and take me out. There's another Icicle Crash. No flinch. No flinch. A flinch, and we're done. We're just done. All right, recover. Thank goodness. The recoveries are reals. Back up to 117. So we're going to be spamming a lot of recovers and such here right now. Here's another Icicle Crash. Ice go crash. Doing a little bit of damage there. We're going to get another recover off. So not bad. The good thing is, is we're doing damage here to Mount King Zero. To where we can at least attack him and finish him off with something else if we need to later. Let's see what's going to happen. Or is he going to switch out? He's probably going to go ahead and withdraw. There it is. Withdraw. What's coming out? Here comes Rocco. What is Rocco? Rocco is. There he is. There he is. We're going to go ahead and throw an Ice Beam at him. Yoink. do do nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing I do see. <laughs> Alright, so how to deal with Rocco now. Rocco actually checks most of my team. So. Huh. That Charizard was supposed to be for Rocco. It really was. I'm really bummed out still. And yes, I know I'm going through the darn freaking rocks. So my Dargon has been neutered. Here comes Knockoff. That's fine. Weakness Posse knocked off. That's fine. 
But at this point, it's like, Gray, what are we going to do from here? We're going to go ahead and just throw a stab Dragon Claw against this Rocco. Because we're going to be faster than Rocco still. Dragon Claw! Get some damage. Not bad damage. Here comes an Ice Punch. That's going to finish off our Dargon. Dargon goes down and out. Lame! Lame! <laughs> so we know he's got Ice Punch. Let's see here. We're going to have to send this guy out. Here comes Tim Allen. Gonna take a little bit of damage here. That's a thing. That is a thing. And we're gonna go ahead and run a fake out. Get some damage here. Um, he's gonna withdraw Rocco, so what's gonna come in and take out fake out damage? Kame Jr. Kame Jr. is uh, that guy, that big old turd. <laughs> so here comes fake out on him. Kame Jr. is gonna take some good damage there. We're going to take some HP loss. And he's got leftovers, so all the damage ain't gonna matter. Because he's got that. Huh, <sighs> lay side, lay side, base side. Let's go for this. Here we go. We're going for the double hit. It's gonna be enough to finish off Kame Jr. Oh, it just might be. Kame Jr. gone. Kame Jr. gone. Not even bad. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So down he goes. Let's see what's gonna come out next. So Kame Jr. down and out. Yoink. But still got a lot of strong pokes left. We don't really have much left. So we gotta figure out how to deal with it. Hmm. You know what? Screw it. We're just gonna have to do it. There's no point. Here goes the mock punch. That may finish us off. Come on, Tim Allen, survive! No survival by Tim Allen. That's going to be it. That's going to be game, guys. We aren't going to be able to do anything else. I don't think we will. I don't think we will. Huh. Well? I don't know if I have enough strength to do something with that. Let me double check. Maybe... Maybe. I don't know. Alright, let's try this. Here we go. We're going to send out Claudia now. Claudia's going to take some Stealth Rocks damage. That's the thing. And we're going to go ahead and throw out this aqua jet nice and powerful aqua jet yo aqua jet away i believe we're faster than rocco i believe we are not 100 percent sure so let's see if we can take him out with that adaptability bonus and such nope there's a withdrawal of rocco what's coming out here's alana what is alana alana is that thing which we haven't even battled yet good lord here comes our aqua jet Nice and damage. Holy crap. Okay, so can we get lucky enough to finish off Alana here? Maybe. You know that Aqua Jet? Can we? That's right at 50%. So we need a high roll. A high roll. If we don't, then we're screwed. <laughs> then we're screwed. That's just straight up it. We're screwed. Here comes Aqua Jet. And Alana's gone. Wow. Alana's done and out. Not even bad. The only problem is, is I don't think we can do anything against the rest of his team. But we're going to try. Gosh darn it, we're going to try. Let's see what comes out. Claudia putting in work right now. Can Claudia do anything about the rest of the team? It's a question. Huh... That's the question, that's the question. So, wow. Getting lucky there with the guard bar. Here comes Queen Falco again. Queen Falco, the Talon Flame is here. The Talon Flame is here, guys. All be prepared. Queen Talon Flame is here. Okay. Talon Flame, I see you, I see you. Claudia, come back. I'm gonna switch out Claudia, and we're gonna send out Tentacruel. He's pretty much done. There's really no point in Tentacruel being around. He survived, but he's going to go down to the burn. Here comes that Brave Bird for three damage. 
And down goes our tentacle baby. The tentacle's down and out. No rapid spin there. And Queen Falco losing some HP there. We're going to go ahead and send out the one, the only, Affleck. So Affleck is here now. Take a little bit of stone damage. We are going to trace Gale Wings. Not that it matters again. But we've got it. We do have it. So let's see if he's going to withdraw to Mammal Swine. Yep. Withdrawal. Show me Mammal Swine. Mount King Zero. Yep. Mount King Zero is here again. Thunderbolt's obviously not going to affect him. So we're going to go back to this long stall play. Here comes that Icicle Crash again. Nice long install. Yoink. So here comes our Ice Beam against Mount King Zero. Nice amount of damage there. Not bad. Here comes an Earthquake from this range. Oh no. Survival, thank goodness. Here comes an Ice Beam. Ice Beam with the damage there. Much needed damage. Now, I know he's going to Ice Crash and hope to get a flinch. If he does, we're screwed. If he does, we're screwed. So hopefully no flinch here. Yes! Mmm! Get that recover when we need it. Um, so yeah, now we're just going to have to Ice Beam Mount King Zero again. Get some more damage. Here comes another Earthquake. There's Earthquakes, though. Here comes another Ice Beam to G-Hammer. Getting that damage, yo. Huh. And another Ice Crash. Going for the flinch already. No flinch. No flinch. Please no flinch. Love me, game. Love me. Yeah. Thank you for loving me, game. I love you too, game. I really do. Getting that health back. Because we need it. We need it, yo. There's another Earthquake. Earthquake happens. Here comes our Ice Beam. Ice Beam nearly got Mount King Zero down and out. Nearly, but not quite. We need to do this. We have to do this. There's another Earthquake. A decent amount of damage. Here comes our recover. It's coming down to the end here right now. Here comes another icicle crash. Ouch. The icicle crash. No flinch. No, gosh! Don't you start with me now, game. Don't you start with me. Don't you start with me now, game. Don't you start with me. There we go. Good lord. Good lord. Good lord. I'll say, if it starts with me, I'm going to cry. I am absolutely going to cry and ball. I will. There's another icicle crash. Survival of the icicle crash. Come on. There we go. Ice beam away. Do a decent amount of damage. Not quite enough. There's the Earthquake. He's getting as much damage as he can on us before the end of this turn. Here comes our Ice Beam on G-Hammer. And down goes Mount King Zero. Now here's the problem now. So Mount King Zero's down. The only problem is the play here. He's got to send out the darn Rocco. Yep. Rocco's here. And he should take me out here. He should. There's like no reason he should not. And that's the problem here. Unfortunately, that's the problem. He should run a drain punch and finish me off. Here comes that Thunderbolt, hoping we can do a massive amount of damage to Rocco, but we don't. Drain punch is going to hurt like a mofo. But we survive it. Wow, goodness gracious. I didn't expect that. That's all it drained. Really? Really? Okay, I didn't think that would happen. A mock punch here could take us out, though. A mock punch here could take us out, but we're going to get a recover off. 
So he's gonna get Rocco back up to full health by draining me. Did we gain anything out of that? Went down to 36. What do we have? He's recovering health through all this. Oh my gosh. We're not doing nothing. We're up to 132. Knockoff is going to knock off our Eviolite. Wow, I totally forgot about knockoff. This is going to be dead Porygon 2. This is a dead P2. Dead P2, probably. Our best bet is the Ice Beam and hope we get a Freeze. That is our best bet. Get a freeze. Do it for daddy. Drain punch. No, 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 no. It didn't happen. <laughs> didn't happen. We're dead. We're dead. Affleck's done. I wasn't going to try to sit there and just draw it out. We were just hoping for the freeze now. Affleck faints, and we've only got one poke left, and he's not going to be able to do anything much. It's Claudia. Claudia's going to take stone damage here. That's going to hurt us by about 18, so it's going to take us about to 100. And the only chance we have right now is by going ahead and running Aqua Jet and hoping it takes him out. The only problem is, even if we were to take out the Conkledur, he's got the darn Town Flame, which is going to come in and swoop down and eat our soul. Oh wow, we survived that. If I knew we were to survive that, we would have probably have ran the Dragon Dance, but it's not going to matter at this point. Aqua Jet, unless we get a crit, isn't going to finish off G-Hammer. Yep, and Mock Punch is going to be the battle. So there's the game, guys. G-Hammer pulling up the win here. Let me know what you guys thought about this battle. I absolutely loved it. It was very interesting. We're trying to learn things with this team. We see some good stuff. We see some bad stuff. The critical mistake early was bringing in my Dargon, forgetting that Stealth Rocks was up. If I had remembered that, I would have just spinned him right there. Could have turned the battle around. But instead, we just lost our Dargon for no reason. But that's the battle, guys. Let me know what you think about it in the chat. And the Romain Rough, but the Jeremy Unforgettable. Until next time, see ya!